Okay, so if you just got Wolfenstein 2 and you're having some issues getting the game up and running, specifically if you have an NVIDIA graphics card, then one of these two fixes may fix whatever problem you're having. The first problem I want to look at is the one where if you change your resolution in the in-game menu, the uh, computer either gives you a blue screen of death or you get your computer to completely restart like mine did, in which case, what you need to do is go to this web page, which I will link it in the description down below. It is a hotfix driver. Basically, the game ready driver from NVIDIA is not quite ready yet for Wolfenstein 2, and this hotfix will at least fix that individual uh, bug that prevents people from changing resolution and causes their computer to crash. So uh, go to this link and download whichever Windows version it is uh, that applies to your scenarios. The other issue I want to uh, go over real quickly is the issue where maybe you started your game in safe mode or maybe you exited your game and have come back in and now you have no menus once the game actually gets into the game. So it loads up, you get to the main menu like you would see your start game, your load game, all those different options are just blank. So you just see a blank canvas. Um, unfortunately, I don't have a screen cap here for that. But to fix that, or at least temporarily fix that while Bethesda works on a fix or an actual fix for the bug, you're going to go into your file menu, and you're going to go to uh, your computer, you're going to go to your C drive, users, your name, you're going to go to games, or rather saved games, you're going to go to machine games, Wolfenstein the New Colossus base, and these config files, all you're going to do here is you're gonna delete the config files. So the .cfg, I don't think you'll have to get rid of the .local file. However, if the .cfg one doesn't work, you may have to check that one out. And then for me, I even had to go into the uh, save game user and uh, get rid of these files as well. Uh, but once I did that, I went into Steam. And when you right click on your game and go to properties, you can disable Steam Cloud Save by unchecking this box. Now, the forum I stumbled across said that you need to do this. I didn't check it without. So, again, if those first steps don't fix that problem of having no in-game menu, come to this menu and uncheck the Enable Steam Cloud Synchronization. Um, get out of Steam. Make sure those config files are still gone. Then restart the game. And hopefully that fixes your problem as it fixed mine. So, those are a couple hot fixes that are available right now for a couple of uh, issues that Steam users are having with the new Wolfenstein 2. Hopefully this did fix your problem. If not, I really apologize. It looks like there are several bugs out there. So hopefully you had one of these two that it fixes. If not, um, I guess just keep looking or wait for that uh, patch coming from Bethesda or Nvidia, depending on who's responsible there. But if you like this content, give it a like, share, subscribe, comment down below. You can follow me on Instagram and on Twitter at Hoosier Hardware. And as always, I'll let YouTube keep up a couple more videos from my channel for you to watch. I'm Shane with Hoosier Hardware. I'll see you guys in the next video.